There has been visible push to foster Korea's own homegrown mega-sized investment banks modeled after Goldman Sachs since 2011. At last, the country's top regulator gives the go-ahead to five IBs to expand their businesses beyond brokerage services. Won jong Wan sheds light on this development. The Financial Services Commission, the country's top financial regulator, issued a license Monday to Korea Investment and Securities, allowing to issue promissory notes and short-term corporate financing. There are four other securities firms, Mirae Setteu, NH Investment and Securities, KB Securities and Samsung Securities, that are also expected to get the go-ahead in the near future. The preparations to nurture giant investment banks in Korea started back in 2011 with a regulatory roadmap to creating a so-called Korea version of Goldman Sachs. But local securities firms didn't yet have the capital. So last year, the financial authorities announced a plan to permit security firms that met a threshold of at least 3.6 billion U.S. dollars of equity capital to go into short-term corporate lending. Those with $7.2 billion or more will be allowed to launch management accounts for corporate investors. Those changes put the big five securities companies on their way to becoming homegrown giant investment banks. And with Monday's decision, the first one now has the right to issue notes. But the traditional banking sector wants the decision to be put on hold as it could disrupt the corporate finance industry. The Korean Federation of Banks said the local securities industry lacks an oversight system to manage the issuance of such notes. Short-term corporate financing has traditionally been the province of commercial banks, which are subject to stricter rules and capital requirements. So there is some concern that the creation of home-ground mega-sized investment banks in Korea could destabilize the industry, especially amid a lack of regulation. Won Jong-un, Arirang News.